overall looking back, you know, disappointed in the results. Not disappointed in how we played. Um, you know, I thought the, the guys worked really hard, extremely hard. Um, really, you know, carried the play, uh, limited uh, Bemidji in their scoring opportunities, and, and created our own. Uh, so overall, I, was, I was, you know, can't be disappointed in how we played. Uh, obviously, the results, yeah, you want more, but uh, every point is important in this league. Uh, as you see, the standings fluctuate from night to night. So as long as we can continue to get points every weekend like we have the last few, uh, we'll be in good shape down the road. I think we should have came out with four points on the weekend. Uh, Cliff's stick broke Friday night. That was kind of that led to their game tying goal. Uh, I think they had strong goaltending, but uh, I think we definitely could have came out with four points. Uh, I think we had a good weekend. Uh, we're definitely not satisfied with two ties, but I think uh, we played pretty well. I think we deserved more than we got this weekend, but uh, it was encouraging to see all four lines play well. Defense were all strong, six back there, and Phoenix had a great weekend as well. So I think uh, fans should be encouraged by this weekend's play. Yeah, it says a lot about our team and our, you know, our grit and our determination. I think, uh, like you said, only giving up two goals. Obviously, it says a lot about Phoenix's play. I think he's been uh, phenomenal uh, these last you know, six games. Uh, you know, I think uh, as for our forwards too are all coming back to the house and playing really well defensively, you got to give them credit. And then obviously the decor, we've been, uh, you know, solid clearing pucks. I think freshmen have done a great job and we're playing well defensively, so we've got to keep that up. You know, Daniel Holmberg got a real big goal for us the first night uh, to get us tied in the game. And then uh, obviously Brad Stebner's goal uh, Saturday night put us ahead. So it was uh, uh, a big time goal and he joined the rush. And we need more of that from our defensemen. We need them to get up in the rush. The team's back check so hard now, but and you need a defenseman to try and get that out, outnumbered rush. And yeah, as a defenseman, uh, our back check is getting up ice and make sure we're, making sure we're up with the play. Uh, Paten, uh, you know, had a great rush. He delayed there and threw it back to me, and I uh, just threw it on net, and obviously it uh, took a good bounce and went in. Yeah, Tanner's got, uh, you know, he possesses really good speed. He can really skate. I think that's, you know, if you ask me one thing that is his biggest strength is the skating, and at times he's tried to be a little too cute with the puck, and uh, finesse things, but uh, on this goal, I mean, he just pulled it and went wide, uh, drove to the net hard. And I like to see more of that, uh, not only from Tanner, but our team. And did a nice job of sticking out his leg and protecting uh, uh, the puck. And uh, I expect him to go all the way back, you know, across the net. And but he came back and made that little Pavel Datsuk uh, move, and uh, you know, it was a big time goal. So uh, good for Tanner and good for our team. I think we've put ourselves in a pretty good spot right now, especially uh, going into this weekend. If we can have a good weekend uh, going into the Christmas break, I think we'll be uh, you know, somewhere where we thought we might be. Uh, obviously, we, I thought we were going to have questions on, uh, on defense uh, more than scoring goals, and it's just turned out it's the opposite. You know, We're having trouble putting the puck in the net on a consistent basis, but uh, our defense has really carried us. So uh, given uh, the injuries uh, you know, with David Johnstone and and some of the ones on defense and where we're at. Uh, you know, I'd be pretty happy if we can get into that top four at the Christmas break.